Hey guys, it's Queen Nija, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to episode 1 of 227. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Oh. <clears throat> That's true. Mm hmm Oh. I don't think oh 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 yeah I, I don't think she liked that her baby She seems kind of like, um, Miki or Miku? Miku. Miku from, um, After School Dice Club. Very to herself. Very shy. It makes you wonder how someone like her could be an idol, you know? But she's adorable, though. Oh my god, it's so precious! Okay, um, we do an opening? It, it looks like an opening. Ooh. I'm already seeing it. It's good as fuck. <laughs> it's only the opening, though. Okay. So the only thing I know about this show is this group has been together for a while. I heard that some girls have left and they had to get different voice actors for it. I just found out um, there's an OVA for this. And this OVA came out two years ago in 2018. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and watch this first episode, of course. And then either tomorrow or sometime next week, I'll watch the OVA. And I'll have that out for you guys before... Um, next Saturday's episode. And I did listen to some of their music and it's actually really good. And I'm kind of hoping that with this show, um, it's been in 3D. The characters were 3D in their music video. I wonder if they're going to go 2D and it seems like they're going to do that thing. And you know what? I'm okay with that. Nope, they're going 3D. And I'm fine with that too. And I do know there's going to be a game coming out for this series. I don't know when, but later on, probably later on this year, maybe. You? Ah. 
I'm guessing our mom is possibly always sick. Keyboard. It could be fine. And we already know you're going to say yes to it. I mean, why would they show that stuff at the beginning and then come back to here, you know? Guys, it's a sign. <laughs> like her? No, Mio. No, you are adorable. Are you okay? <laughs> yeah, I don't think so either. <laughs> Okay, I'm already liking Sato. Because Sato seems like she's mate. They all seem like a high school student, but she seems like a senior. Oh, you're pretty too! Iconic. Is it like nine girls in the group? One, two, three, four, five. That's six. So we need three more. She has to be one of them. Mm hmm And you are? <laughs> <laughs> I 
Nice to meet you, Miyako. <laughs> Honestly, I like them all. Yeah, there should possibly maybe be one more. Oh. Are you the producer? Well, that was easy. <laughs> it's just, it's something about you that made them choose you. And maybe later on in the series, we might find out. You have nothing else to go on. You have everything to lose and gain, so go. Go on. But you know, when this game come out, they gonna make bank. I can only imagine how much money I'm going to put towards this game. If it's going to be like Madoka Magica and then freaking Fate. <laughs> oh, God. One for each of them. <laughs> Who would have thought something like this would be under a zero? <laughs> Out of all the things. It's awesome! My god! Their room? Mm hmm. So you basically want them to just stay here? What is the wall's purpose? Okay. Okay, Mr. Manager. Yeah. Okay. Right.
She's right about that, though. Yeah. Too well. We know that already. But you know, if you become an idol, you can help your family. Hmm. You're basically being laid off. Or you're, he's giving you a break. Seriously? Mm -hmm. Just try. But me, you. You know who she re also reminds me of? Um, what's her face from Sound Euphoria? Oh my god, like dead ass. Because of the fact is, not only because of that, the art style and everything, because so I think someone from Kyoto Animation is working on this show. And you can see it in the eyes and everything. Me. Oh. 
But wait, Mew! But she's gonna come! Excuse me. I get them. No. Well, I I'm guessing the law kind of, you know, supports that decision. Maybe, I don't know. All right, I got a lot of questions, especially about this wall and stuff. I, I, I mean, who knows what? For, I mean, the it, okay, the manager, their their producer in a way, explained as much as he could about this wall, but still, there's so many unanswered questions, and the fact that it reacted to Mio's general emotions means that any girl, like, uh, whether they're going to feel happy or sad or um, any different type of emotion, it's going to go along to those feelings. It gives me a little feels towards Idol Master, a teeny tiny bit. I'm kind of getting feels from another, I it's a really old Idol series that um, I have not watched in years, and I would love to sit and rewatch it. Um, I think it's Pop Chance, Chance Pop Session or Pop Chance Session. It's one of the two. Chance Pop or Pop Chance, that show. It's really old, but it's so freaking good. I recommend it to anybody. But, I mean, I stand it. I love it. The girls are interesting. I want to know more about these girls. And it makes me wonder, like, whenever this game comes out, whenever it comes out to Ian, I'll play it on JP first, then I'll play it on Ian. I'll probably find out within this series, whether it's 12 episodes or 24 episodes, who in the end might be my best girls, because as of right now, for episode one, it's just an introduction to all these girls. I do like Mew, I mean, Mew a lot. I think she's very interesting. Um, I love the fact that she says what is on her mind, just like What's-Her-Face, my other best girl from Sound Euphorium, and that's why they're very similar, because I do like it when characters do speak, like, how they're currently feeling and not bottling it all up inside. And she seems like that kind of girl who's going to just instantly say what the hell is on her mind. Even though she is very shy and timid and to herself. And she doesn't like when people do certain things, especially like moving her bangs out of the way and such. But honestly, when she smiled in that like first few minutes, like she was just gorgeous. Like I can't. She's just so adorable. I love them. Like, I love them all. I just don't know who's going to be my best girl. Like, God, th this is eight girls. And, I mean, as someone who's already in that idol community, been in that idol community for a long freaking time, and there's always new idol series, because somebody wants me to watch um, a Yuri idol series, and it's between that and this, like, um, 
other like cutesy horror edge series that I really want to watch. I might in the end watch both. I know they think I think they both come out Thursdays. I may have time for both of them. I don't really know yet. But I mean I really want to know what the hell is going to happen next with this show because there's so many unanswered questions about why they were being chosen, especially with this wall. What else is the wall's purpose? There has to be something else. And who, I, I'm hoping and praying we find out later on in this series because, like I said, I got a lot of freaking questions about this. But I enjoyed the first episode. I think all the girls are interesting. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to Beatrice episode 1 of 227. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Marshall Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for episode 2. Bye, guys. Thank you.